Efficiency is the key for Mildura grain grower Chris Hunt, who is looking to cut his fertiliser bills by adopting precision agriculture techniques, which match his seeding and fertiliser rates to the varying soil types on his property. Uh, basically the country's sort of roll and melly country, which ranges from heavy flats up to quite sandy hills or rises. Um, and yeah, so that we try and farm to the soil types that we've got here. And yeah, depending on the year as to what soil type's got the most yield potential. In implementing the PA system, Mr Hunt wants better information to guide his farming practices. He is participating in a series of water use efficiency and fertiliser trials being conducted by Mallee Sustainable Farming and the Grains Research and Development Corporation. The trials are assessing the response of different soil types to in-crop fertiliser applied at growth stage Z31. So what we've done with the Mallee Sustainable trials is we've um, got three test strips that have been sampled and then in the three strips we've got a centre strip where we've applied no additional nitrogen in crop. On one strip we've applied about 50 kilograms of urea in crop and then on the other strip we've applied 100 kilograms of urea um, and across all three zones so just to see where we're getting our bang for buck on the nitrogen because um, yeah basically spread top dressing at the moment we aim to get it on our sandy country because that's where we believe we need it and testing seems to prove that but I guess it's a bit of ground truthing. By feeding this information into his PA system Mr Hunt hopes to cut his input cost and maximise his yields. It's about getting your input use more efficient it's about um, spending the dollars where you're going to get the gain and cutting back on the dollars where you don't get the gain so basically it's farming the zones not just farming to square paddocks so um, as you can sort of see by the countryside it rises and falls and yeah it's just spending the money where we can make the dollars and yeah saving it where we don't.